Duncan Larkham forewarns Royal as he presses Queen to stop them while still can for another tell-all interview my erupt because Harry is eagering to advertise new book and pushing the royal to breaking point. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle could push the royal family to breaking point if they do a second tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey, a royal expert has warned. The Sussexes are reportedly planning another interview with an A-list TV star, after revealing in their previous interview one member of the royal family questioned what the color of their son Archie's skin would be before he was born. However, nothing has yet been confirmed. Royal biographer Duncan Luckham, author of Prince Harry, The Inside Story, told Closer magazine, Harry and Meghan have caused chaos and I suspect there's no stopping them. I can totally see more of these high-profile. Hollywood-style interviews with A-list TV hosts happening. He told Closer Magazine, I really wouldn't be surprised if they're planning another Oprah interview. Harry and Meghan have caused chaos and I suspect there's no stopping them. I can totally see more of these high-profile, Hollywood-style interviews with A-list TV hosts happening. Especially if there's lots of money being offered for it. Especially if there's lots of money being offered for it. Harry will need a promotion for his memoir due to be released next autumn, too. Another Oprah interview, if it's anything like the last, would surely push the royals to breaking point. Meanwhile, just last week, Meghan appeared on The Ellen Show, where she gave a much more light-hearted interview to talk show host Ellen DeGeneres. And now royal expert and biographer Duncan Larkin says he can see Meghan and Harry doing another high-profile interview, even possibly with Oprah again. It has been claimed that Harry and Meghan will not be flying to the UK to join the Queen for her first Christmas without the late Prince Philip despite recent concerns over her health. The couple has reportedly been invited to join the rest of the royals at Sandringham for the festive period. It would be the first chance for royal family to meet Lilibet, the Queen's namesake great-granddaughter, who the couple welcomed in June. Meghan and older son Archie have yet to return to the UK since they left for the US last year. The Queen has faced a number of health concerns in recent weeks, after being hospitalized for a night in October and then having to cancel her appearance at the Remembrance Day service after spraining her back. But a source told Page Six, there's a lot that goes into the logistics and the planning of the family Christmas, so of course, staff know that Harry and Meghan are not coming. If they were, they would have communicated it to their family by now. But this is Her Majesty's first Christmas without her husband, so one would have hoped they would want to be with her. The Sussexes have not commented on the claims. and biographer Duncan Larkham says he can see Meghan and Harry doing another high-profile interview, even possibly with Oprah again. It has been claimed that Harry and Meghan will not be flying to the UK to join the Queen for her first Christmas without the late Prince Philip despite recent concerns over her health. The couple has reportedly been invited to join the rest of the royals at Sandringham for the festive period. It would be the first chance for royal family to meet Lilibet, the Queen's namesake great-granddaughter who the couple welcomed in June. Meghan and older son Archie have yet to return to the UK since they left for the US last year. 
The Queen has faced a number of health concerns in recent weeks, after being hospitalized for a night in October and then having to cancel her appearance at the Remembrance.